Don't mind me. I was just out uh, fighting some monsters. Yeah, somehow I got the Master Sword in Monster Hunter. I don't know how that happens. Oh, I had to channel my inner link, take out the monsters. Oh, man. Whew. All right, so uh, let me catch my breath here. Hey! Mm -mm. Oh, there was one that almost came over here. All right, here's the thing. We have a leak for Monster Hunter. Now, before we get to the leak, there is some real news involved here. Next week, it has been announced there is an event happening on April 27th at 7 a.m. Pacific time. Uh, you know, 9 a.m. my time. I'm central time. Uh, and that is for, well, da -da 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 -da. Monster Hunter. Um, they're doing an event. They're going to talk about the 2.0 update in Monster Hunter Rise. And yeah, we're going to get new details on Monster Hunter stories now here's the thing that's great that's amazing news that's a great way to start off this video but what if i were to tell you that i have additional information what if i was able to tell you i've actually verified that where this information came from what if i was able to tell you that there's now a person i no longer consider it to be rumors you guys remember when we were talking about Samus Hunter and the E3 stuff? Do you guys remember when uh, I was wondering, you know, is this person legit? They've gotten everything right. Well, not only did this 2.0 update confirmation they're going to be talking about next week obviously already confirm something that Samus Hunter did along with the Ace Attorney stuff. I have actually now talked to Samus Hunter behind the scenes. And no, I will not dive into the personal details and the additional information I might know. <laughs> um, I mean, I do know. Uh, because... It's sensitive, and I don't want to get anyone in trouble, including Samus Hunter, let alone the people uh, that he's in contact with. But I was able to verify that Samus Hunter is getting his information from extremely legit places, and that's really all I could say about it. That being said, today, he decided to put up a bunch of leaks for Monster Hunter Stories 2 that we're likely going to be finding out next week. Uh, and the, he, there, there's some of these, actually, he, he talked about back in March. So we're going to first talk about the March ones, and then we're going to talk about the new ones uh, and all this stuff that we're going to be finding out because monster hunter stories too to be honest is something hey, hey, hey. stay i got creeped out sometimes um monsters are just trying to overtake the set let's just say that there are times uh when i am not um sure if i really enjoy monster hunter uh, I've been having fun with Monster Hunter Rise, but everything about the game isn't always perfect. It's not always exactly what I want it to be. Well, Monster Hunter Stories feels like a game that's probably more up my alley. I have dabbled in the original Monster Hunter Stories. This is the second one, and I think that this game could actually be a bigger deal for me and probably a bigger deal for a lot of you guys. So let's get into some of the stuff he talked about back in March. Let's get into the new stuff he's talking about now. And yeah, I don't consider this rumors anymore. This is just straight up information being leaked. Uh, so let's just get into it. Now, um, I kind of have like some stuff like blacked out and everything. Uh, it, uh, it, some stuff I can talk about, some stuff I can't. So first off, it says, uh, if you want to know more about Monster Hunter Stories 2, uh, you can control the characters in battle with an active monster with each character. And you can co-op with an NPC, and it's possible that there's a PvP mode in the game around 90 monsters as well in the base game so that's just some basic information i i obviously will see this stuff next week um i'm pretty excited about that he goes on to say also monsters are planned uh for monster hunter world including uh nergarante uh legania toby kadachi uh paoluma puke bazagais kulav taraf um so those are like some of the ones that are coming over from monster hunter world Again, I probably butchered all those pronunciations. I'm not really good at that, but it is what it is. Uh, next up, he says there's going to be a customizable protagonist. There's also going to be 800 plus pieces of equipment, six areas with a base in each area, and dungeons across the region. There's going to be free and paid DLC after launch. So that's all stuff that he talked about back in March. And then I, here's the stuff that he, he talked about today in addition to that. So um, the main villages of the games and the key story events. So again, spoilers here. Uh, if you don't want to know the, the main villages and you don't want to know which, spo which spoiler event happens in which uh, city. Uh, but we got uh, Mahana Village is where the last egg is going to be at. Ruto Village. <laughs> is that a shout out to Zelda there? Uh, where the Hatch Khan Village. Um, or where the hatch is at, sorry. Then we have Con Village, uh, which is where the bond is at. And then uh, Lelusian and New Felenia. 
takes off the village of legends the truth the sealed lands um the sealed lands is the ending of the game so uh yeah that's that's what we we now know uh and we'll obviously get more details about likely next week so maybe not the ending per se maybe the ending comes later uh but i'm just really i <sighs> Some people aren't really into leaks, right? Like, when we talk about a lot of rumors, I think there's a, a huge amount, a, like, a huge crowd out there that doesn't want rumors to be real because they don't want information to actually be leaked. Uh, but at the same point, I like what Samus Hunter does with the stuff he leaks. He doesn't leak anything that's critical. Uh, as I said, I've talked to him behind the scenes, and I now know a few things that I can't talk about um, because these are things that he wouldn't want to bring up because he doesn't want to really spoil things that bad. Yeah, we talked about, oh, these events happened, but what are the events? How do you do the events? What's the exciting part? What do these villagers look like? None of that's here. So... It doesn't really take away the excitement I have for Monster Hunter stories, too. So I guess thank you so much, uh, <laughs> Samus Hunter, and thank you for contacting me and um, being able to verify some things. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy these leaks and you turn into the event next week. You know we will be live stream reacting to that event, maybe even a small tease of uh, what we have going on for our E3 set. Otherwise, folks, thank you so much for tuning in. I am Nathaniel Robo Jansen. I, 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 I gotta go take care of this monster. Uh, uh, hey, giveaway. We have a giveaway going on. $100 cash money. It's down, it's down, in, the, down in the comments below. What oh, we got? Get over here. Ah!